hey welcome back to the channel I wanted to jump on here and show you all Bryce's brand new 2020 GMC Sierra that he bought the other day and we are just so blessed to have been able to get him a truck and I just wanted to show you a little glimpse of it I know nothing about trucks but I do know that it's a flatbed and it's a beautiful work truck that he really really needed so you just enjoy this little um, montage of his truck that I took. See you in a minute. channel if you're new here welcome to my channel so today is another one of these fun filled videos where we do tons of tie-dye so I love to tie-dye I'd really love to bleach dye also but I wanted to just try a couple different tie-dye techniques and bring you guys along because I would really like to wear these all to my son's first birthday party that is on the 25th so it'd be really fun just to have a bunch of shirts that are tie-dyed and fun we're just having a outside water party we're having a water slide and all of that so it'd be really cute just to have a bunch of matching interesting cute wonderful colorful pastel and just a colorful bra t-shirts so that's what we're gonna do today i'm gonna go ahead and try this right a writ dye that I've been seeing everybody use. I'm gonna try a bunch of different types of tie-dye like the um, spiral and the heart and all of that different thing. So hope you guys enjoy. I have a couple of different bottles to spray with. I have these little bottles that are just little squirt bottles. So we're gonna try a couple of different types of ways and my mom is here and she's gonna be joining me I'm not sure when so I will see you guys in just a second all right guys so what we have first is I'm gonna try the ice tie-dye technique which you need a some type of bucket with a grate to put over it. And what I did was I stole this out of my freezer. So no judgment there. Definitely being judged. So, <laughs> and ball it up really well, which stretch it really, not ball it up. And then we're gonna go grab our, our ice out of the freezer and put one layer of ice over the shirt. We're gonna go ahead and get our ice, which I'm putting here. And hey, hey and I are gonna, this is my nephew Hayden, stand up in the chair. We're gonna put a layer of ice on top. Mm -hmm. 
I think I'm going to use yellow in the right color and they just posted it yeah, down below blue. in the picture. I'm going to do yellow idea. and blue and we're going to dilute it in this, this bottle and pour it in there. Okay, so we have the yellow ready and made right here and now we're going to make some navy blue and Mama brought to our attention that we needed gloves, so we do have gloves. crumple which is what I did with the other one. I wanted to try it with JoJo's. Four 
Got my straps, I'm gonna flip it and make sure it don't need none on the other side. What you do? I think that'll be kind of Alright, this one's a plain old spiral. Take a fork, go in the middle. That's what we do when I take. Hey, can you, um, can you put a uh, I think when you're pulling on these. All right, I'm gonna try the polka dot technique that my mom was doing and left those. She did the entire shirt, so. Yeah, it had, it didn't have as many extra kids. Yeah, I'm gonna try that. It's looking like you twist. This might be wrong. This is a rainbow. So you twist it. The rainbow Jesus made. I heard a top. Uh -huh. I am too. Jesus, 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 Jesus. I live to praise your name. Okay, guys. So we have officially waited 24 hours on all of our tie-dyes. So I wanted to go ahead and show you guys before I wash them in case any of the color happens to to go out of the shirt. Well folks, something went terribly wrong in the washer. Or bleeds together. I wanna just go ahead and show you all of them now. All right, first of all, this is the one that I think I just wiped up all the color with. So it still looks pretty cool though. That's the front and this is the back. And this is the two t-shirt, so it's pretty small. It's got kind of a striped effect going, but. So that's the first one. I really like it. I'm loving all the dish different darker colors. Really like that one. This is just the scrunched one I did, and I just put a little bit of color on it. So this is one I just scrunched up into a ball. Still like it, pretty neat. Polka dot one that accidentally got some red on it, but I still really like it. It's very wrinkly, because it still hasn't been washed. We let all the color dry. So that's the front. And here's the back. Cute. That's just plain old bullseye. Another spiral. This is Hayden's. 
which turned out really cool. That's shorty. It's Hayden's shirt. That's shorty. Yeah, ice tie-dye, y'all. This looks so cool in person. But, unfortunately, some of the colors bled through. But I still really like it. And last but not least, here is my mom's polka dot one that she worked so hard on. It is so, so pretty. I'm very jealous. I wish I wouldn't have. I tried to wash out my yellow one in, I mean my ice tie-dye in the bathtub. And that's why it bled together so bad. It had a lot of white in it and it was very pretty. But my mom's looks so cool. Alright guys, so we're going to go ahead and wash those suckers and then we're going to try them on for you. So, stay tuned. Well folks, something went terribly wrong in the washer. Y'all, it is literally so ugly. What happened? Oh my gosh. The next one. <laughs> They're so bad. You saw how pretty they were. They are epic fails. Oh my gosh. I mean, it's not the worst, this is my mom's, and it's not the worst, but it definitely ain't the best. It is so bad. Y'all, it destroyed every shirt. I mean, these are cute for the boys, I guess. I mean, and Joanna can wear them, it's just, <sighs> not the cutest, for sure. They're all dark now. <laughs> and brown. And ugly. All of them. Definitely not wearing these bad boys to the birthday party. Yeah. So. Fail. But, oh, learned our lesson. Um, we used the right, I've, the RIT, right, whatever. And I've never used that before, so honestly, I think I'm just gonna go back to normal dye and do it that way. But, learned our lesson. Did something wrong. I don't know if I washed them wrong, or if I should have waited longer than 24 hours, or what, but. All bad. Man, they were so pretty. This is a fail. I hope you guys enjoyed this video anyways. But wasn't a very good teaching moment. So hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, subscribe and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye. And one will take all the love from those